Hi, Amy. So guess what I did? It took me forever, as you can tell, but I watched Doctor Who. Doctor Who. So I watched two of the episodes you recommended. One of them was Blink, the one with the creepy angel statues, and the other one was the library one. I liked them both. I liked Blink a lot. I find it really creative when you can take a low budget and make a creepy villain. The kind of villain you need to make is like a creepy statue, because you don't have special effects or anything, but you can make a creepy statue, or you can make invisible shadow monsters. You don't need, like, crazy CGI effects for that. They're just what they are. So I find that clever. Okay, there was a theme in both of these episodes that I found dumb. <laughs> there was a moment in each of them where the doctor says to the companion or whoever, yeah, you have these in your world too. If you ever see a shadow, it's got these piranha things in it, or if you ever see a statue, it actually will come to life and pull you into another dimension. And it was just, it felt forced. You know, I didn't, I did not like this show. I tried to watch it. I got through, I figured out six episodes before I stopped. There were so many people that I respect that are like huge fans of this show and I thought what am I missing because I this is horrible. <laughs> I don't like this. It was dumb and campy and I couldn't I just I couldn't but I guess it's one of those shows that you just have to wait until there's a good episode and then it's just really good. I did enjoy the episodes you recommended, so I'm glad that I asked you about it instead of just giving up on the show altogether. Okay, and the other thing I wanted to do, something kind of special happened to me recently. If you don't know, I am a very big baseball fan and I am specifically a Minnesota Twins fan. I just started following the team on Twitter and they were giving all these updates about like, oh, it's college night at the park, you know, everyone can come for $5. And I was like, this sucks because I live far away and I don't like getting updates for things I can't go to. And so I tweeted about that. I'm gonna have to unfollow the twins because I can't go to the Paul Park and it's making me jealous that I live far away. Hashtag JK, I'll still follow, I'm loyal. They PM'd me and said, give us your address, we'll send you something so you can rep it at UNC. They like read my bio and everything and knew where I am. So I was like, seriously? Okay. So they have sent me a box. I don't know what's in it. It is some kind of merchandise. So I'm very excited to find out what this is. This is very light. Like it's, it could be anything. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, it's a hat and a sticker. Look, I got a hat! Wow, it's like a legit hat, too. It's like sizable with the Velcro. It's an $18 hat, <laughs> look. They, well, need to learn their gifting etiquette, but, but I won't fault them for that. This is awesome! I can't believe this! And a sticker! I, ooh, where should I put this? I don't know. Oh, this is so cool! We're gonna win, twins, we're gonna score. Hold on. This is my Homer hanky. In one of the World Series they played, either 87 or 91, one of them, or both of them maybe, they gave out in the newspaper these Homer hankies, and everyone like waved them, and they were the first to do this. So anybody who did this after them was copying, I think. This is so great, yeah! I love being a Minnesota Twins fan, even though it's gonna be a revealing year. We're gonna win twins, we're gonna score, we're gonna win twins, watch that baseball soar. Something hit a home run, I don't remember the rest of the words. Go twins! What a great day! It's spring and it, there's, I have baseball merch and I, I am happy. I hope you're having a fantastic time in London. You are now today moving from London to Ireland. By the time I get this up, who knows, you might be back. I hope you're having fun. It sure sounds like you are. And um, I hope that you are taking videos. I'm sure you are because you care about this. And I care about it too. I hope that you are having things that you will learn cultural becoming British things that you can bring back and teach me about. 
Have a great rest of the day um, and rest of your trip. And I'll see you later. Bye.